Oh, <laughs> it's you. Welcome back. And today, we have a great Andra's Big News. Today is Andra's 13th Christmas of 1980. When I was a little girl, we would get lots of presents on the Christmas tree. Santa gives them we should bring his luck. And then, we always bring cookies together. And it has some milk on it. We have to wait for Christmas Day before Santa gets here at Andrew's house. Because uh, that time, if you don't have to see it, then finally, you have the user information you see, everything I'm supposed to right now. Now this thing happened to tell you right that. So, um, maybe just uh, uh, get this thing and have to show you how. That was the best thing at the time. During uh, Christmas Eve in 1980, when Andrea goes to sleep on my bed and waiting for Santa to come. That's when I have to, have to read this article about this. So, um, let me get your paper ready, and I'll read you the article. So, hold on. <laughs> so, this is your article. Let's read. Andrea's 13th Christmas by Druby. On Christmas Eve of 1980, Andrea's a little girl and have to wait for Sand to come. So, she bring our cookies and milk and the rest of our Christmas trees at Andrea's house. Uh, yet? <laughs> soon, when Andrea goes to sleep on my bed, soon, the Santa comes arrive at Andrea's house. So, he's, uh, he's, he's getting down to the chimney and you bring uh, bring Andrew's presents under the tree, and then Andrew wakes up. And she said, "Are you not ready?" <laughs> I was rub my eyes. So next downstairs, I can't wait. She be. And Andrew's parents has said. Merry Christmas. <laughs> well, I think I got some for me. I just have to make sure that then, and that was me. I'm not doing until next birthday until 1981. Uh, this notice, and we're hoping you have a great time for spending the holiday season. I my luck to you, all my friends and family. For all this year, uh, Grandpa Andy says, We hope you a great Christmas of 1980 since your new decade. Uh, yet? <laughs> Once you always just have to see it. And finally, yeah, you get some user information, you'll see that Santa has a reindeer down for my presents. And I didn't always just have to see it. And then, you know, you have to make sure for this thing. And this is how she has people for us there. But that's true. Why would you want to see her? Because then she has to me. And, um, first she always says, I have to see her. But finally, if you have these people for us there, then she's only have to see her that way. And you're going to have to pay her there. But one thing, I didn't have to tell you about this. You got, I wish you always said, I have to see the <laughs> so, so Santa went back to the sleigh, and he leave Andrea's house, and starting to fly. And he brought out of sight, he said loud and clear, Merry Christmas to all, and good holiday cheers! The end. That was a great Andrea story. So that way, I only have to make sure for this day, and um, once you start, I always seem to make it happen, make it easier, which is uh, 
uh, renewed decades of 1980s than usual. But you know, it's just that you have to make sure for the nostalgia thing, you have to see it. If you get a mother of PC utilities, you can also get your birthday and you get your Christmas presents. And finally, you get your birthday presents on from September 14th, 1980. Uh, I don't know, it's just to see it. And finally, you get the use of recognition you see. And just about the rest of the rest of the word it goes. That what this dude does is, uh, I just don't have to make it happen to them. And it reaches us, um, what you know is uh, like an eight performance. Like an eight performance. Okay, that's about it for this video. I hope to see you again soon for another very nostalgic Christmas series. So this is Dewey Melly, sign off. Thank you for watching my video. If you liked this all, please like, subscribe, and follow me on Blogger. The addresses are located at the bottom. Until next time, this is Dewey Melly, sign off.